What's going on guys and welcome back to another episode of the Road to Glory series. This hasn't been uploaded in genuinely like a month and I'm sorry about that, I've been on holiday and um, I was on holiday last week so and the week before that so I had no kind of videos to up apart from ones I could make on my laptop there so that's why there was a lot of the transfer videos and stuff like this but it's going to be a lot of a, it's going to be a bigger, bigger range of videos now coming on this channel. The Road to Glory series will be back. I have recorded up to episode 10 and including episode 10 so I have already uh, got a lot from the past. This was recorded about a month ago, episode 8 was recorded about a month ago, episode 9 about 3 weeks ago and episode 10 I recorded yesterday guys. So the next 3 episodes or so should be quite old but after that they'll be brand new and I'll try and upload them every couple of days. But as you can see we went into the first game guys um, and we did go down 1-0 and unfortunately for us that is how it ended. A dis disappointing start to the return of this Road to Glory series, but we wanted to try and um, we want to try and get in a lot of new players in this series. Quite early on, we want to try and buy in the players. At this time, I believe Team of the Season was still out, so we had the chance of get uh, of getting players for cheaper because more packs have been opened. There's um, more players in the market, which means they go down in price. So we wanted to try and get as much uh, as many players as possible and kind of take advantage of this time in FIFA. We went into the second game though, um, and. At this moment in FIFA, I wasn't playing extremely well. I'm not gonna lie, I was kind of losing games. I should be winning and stuff like that. But I wanted to try and improve in that in this Road to Glory series. I didn't want a bad record. I didn't want a lot of losses on the record. Um, so I tried my hardest to win this game. And as you can see, we picked up with Cali on here, cutting inside, and look at that for a finish. Stunning finish from him in the sixth minute to give us the one 0 lead. We then did win it back. A story of getting the ball into Cali on a Cali on back to uh, his Saj or however you say Cali on then again into Hamstick. And can you just beat that finish? Quality, quality finish um, from Hamseek there. I love that guy in this game. He's so good, Hamseek. If you haven't tried him, guys, you need to. He's honestly quality. As you can see, he did get a goal back here in the 24th minute. Lovely cut inside and a lovely finish from him. But we didn't go through with Ed there. Sweated that one right across to Churchy, who finished that one home to make us um, to make us more comfortable in the game. To give us a, a broader, a broader uh, kind of lead I suppose you could say. As you can see again though Calion picking it up and what a finish. How he gets it in from there I genuinely have no idea guys. He's a quality quality player Calion this year and he has been in previous years as well and I hope he stays in Napoli because I enjoy using him in the Serie A squad. We made it 5-1 here and this was just before um, I believe half time or full time even whatever it was. Half time it's half time and this is when he did in fact rage quit guys. So we did get the win which I'm pretty happy about. 5-1 victory as well, which isn't too bad. Not going to complain with that. Um, but yeah, guys, I am obviously recording this, as I said, from quite a while back. So we are currently still in that tournament for the team of the season, Sansone, which was when the Serie A um, and League 1 team of the seasons were out, which was a long, long time, over a month ago now. And hopefully you guys don't mind, the next few episodes are going to be from previous, uh, from quite a while back. But starting episode 10, it will be current time. Um, so hopefully you guys will enjoy that. I'm going to be uploading probably double uploads um, most days throughout the summer because of course I'm off and I've got a lot more time and stuff like that. I'm going to record a lot more football videos. Hopefully in the coming days um, I can maybe record some of them. Hopefully you guys will um, watch them. Hopefully in the previous uh, football videos I have done, hopefully you guys have enjoyed them as well. So I'm looking forward to doing that. But as you can see guys, we went into the third game and we seemed to go up against a lot of guys that had a lot of bronze players, which I'm not complaining about, but um, it seemed like, it seemed a bit, it, it just happened a lot and it was a bit um, weird to play against. He had one silver though and three gold, so it might not have been the worst team possible. We did have Miranda in there as well, who is a pretty decent player. We picked up with Churchy here, as you can see, great ball through to Callion, and yet again, Callion showing his strength and desire to get that one in the back of the net. Really nice goal from him, and he did then punt it up, as you can see. I don't know who that was that uh, collected it. I think it might have been Callion again. We picked up Dybala here, played through Callion, and he got yet another goal. In fact, that wasn't even Callion. What am I talking about? That, ha that was Hamseek. Um, but picking up this time of Callion, that's not a lie. This time it was Callion. And that is possibly the goal of the episode. Great strike from him, making it 3-0, guys. And at this point, the guy just knew. He was just like, you know what? I'm not going to beat this guy. There's no chance of even playing anymore. He did pause the game. And as you can see, he did go ahead and rage quit the match. So yet again, we get another rage quit win in this series. We seem to be getting quite a lot of them, um, which I'm kind of happy about. So hopefully that can continue into the next episodes and stuff like that, guys. We did win the title as well, as you can see, with 13 
point, and it, it was a, it's kind of, in road to glory and stuff like that, winning the titles is kind of your main ambition, um, every time you get into the division you don't want to lose it, you want to try and have the best record possible, you want to try and get through the divisions as quickly as possible, um, and we are we do seem to be doing that quite quickly, I know we're in episode 7, and I'm only in division uh, 9 or 8 or something like that, but that's because we have been playing quite a lot of tournaments, and that's why I've got quite a lot of losses as well, but you'll see in the next few episodes guys, those less I'm just gonna give you a quick hint, those last those, those losses, I can't even speak, those losses did not go up that much. But as you can see we made a massive signing in the series. Raja and I go on 83 rated from Roma. We signed him and put him in the squad. We sent Kelly on to the club, um, of course, because he had no contract, which is sad to see. He's a very, very good player, Kelly on, and I really, really do enjoy using him. Of course, we did have still have quite a few um, non rears that I did want to get rid of. You don't really like having the non rears in your squad. Um, so if we could get rid of them as soon as possible, that would have been great. As you can see, we went out and bought a Gomez, who is the left winger in the Serie A with like 89 pace or something like that. Very, very fast. Um, as you can see, we picked the wrong Gomez at first. But we went to left wing, Serie A, um, 700 coins. And you'll see in a minute, we did in fact find a Gomez, I believe, for um, roughly 700 coins, as you can see there. But, if you've got any suggestions guys, who I should buy in this series, I've not made massive changes, well I have, in the next episode or the episode after that, you'll see a few changes, but, after that guys, if you get any players you want to see me do, if you get any squads you'd like to see me build in this Road to Glory series, just comment them down in the comment section down below guys, and I'll get them done for you, Um, because, I just want to do kind of, um, videos and stuff, maybe even, uh, just squads and stuff you guys want to do it it saves me from, from maybe doing squad builds and stuff like that I can just build it into the road to go this uh, thing instead it's completely up to you guys so you guys make sure to tell me in the comment section down below and I'll try and get that done for you guys if you're worrying about the transfer um, episodes I know I have not played them the last two or three days but they will be back starting tomorrow I believe um because I've got another I've got a shout out Monday. I'm going to change it to shout out Monday. You will hear the announcement later today, but I have got a shout out um, video coming out later today, so hopefully you guys will watch that as well. Make sure to stay active on my channel, guys. That is one of the main rules for the shout out um, Monday now is series, so hopefully you guys do enjoy um, do enjoy my videos and just stay active for that st sort of thing as well. But as you can see, we did also buy Rudiger, put him straight in the squad, um, took out a story who, of course, doesn't have the most pace. He's at 60. I mean, it's not bad pace, but we wanted kind of faster centre back, so we got Bonucci and Rudiger. Bonucci's not that fast, but he has got a lot of strength and really great um, defending stats and stuff like that. But hopefully, you guys have enjoyed today's video. Leave a like if you had. Subscribe, guys, as well if you're new to the channel. Apart from that, I'll see you guys next time. What's going on, guys? And today we have episode 7 of my Transfer Rumor series. Hopefully, you guys are enjoying this series so far. You have been smashing the likes on it. We've hit over 20 likes on the last couple of episodes.